The city life has been getting me down. Going to catch a train and head out of town. And all my friends will be hanging around. Around that 44. Who did this to you, Toey? He said he did. And Don just went bang and knocked this big buff head into the urinal backwards. She went down to Jeringong to have the babies and then when they came back, she had to get off the wagon and walk because it was so steep. Fog, thick fog. It was the first year we had fireworks. We couldn't see the fireworks. I thought it was the end of the world. What's going on? There's been a nuclear fallout and here comes the cloud. The bus proprietor, he only had one eye. And uh, he, he said, I can't see. I grabbed my tiara. So I'm belting up the bloody Illawarra Highway here, mitt gum boots, bloody dressing gun, and tiara, stopping the cars. Stop, stop, stop. Show me how you'd like to get on now if only you stay like you do. There's a new art movement and it's at your Robbo. He said, you never want to go to Robertson. I said, why? And he said, oh, the crime rate. <laughs> yeah, I think Robertson is the center of the universe. We have the best cemetery in Australia. It occurred to me that maybe I could make the graveyard into a piece of music. Well, if you can hear anything because of the rain. Well, if you can hear me over the rain. It rained for 13 weeks straight. Cows are getting bogged in the paddock. For a small town, this town punches pretty hard. In a little village like this, uh, all sorts of things happen. Very, very, very big sense of community here. And everybody wants to feel part of a community, don't they? You want to feel like you belong. It is a sense that you live in an area where you're known. Most people that come here accept the values that's been here for a long, long time. It has everything. It has the pub, the church, the bowling club, the station. It's actually a terrific village. Mm -hmm.